we present the features of a construction management program named Moonstone. At the same time, we take this opportunity to discuss how to build a package program similar to Moonstone. Determine user interface for the program. It is considered that the Rebonks custom user interface is the most efficient. Determine required worksheets for program and predefined worksheet contents. Press start button on the ribbon. Worksheets required for this program are generated with predefined form and headings. Calendar data with minimum input to be further refined according to project requirement. Project data for design, logistics and construction. Construction SCH with three tiers timeline. Progress data, plot plan. Resource chart. Resource supply for maximum supply and schedule. If program includes schedule work, need to define project calendar. Press calendar button on the ribbon. A dialog shows up to facilitate project calendar, either referring to 6 piece of file or directly on the worksheet. If you want to create project calendar, choose calendar option and a year of interest. It is necessary to set the basis of schedule including project scopes such as DStack, stacking. The basis needs to be modified to meet project needs. Press scope button on the ribbon to show a dialog designed for this purpose. Assemble project data from related departments by importing rather than copy forward slash pasting and consolidate in a worksheet named project data. Engineering and design data. Logistics data. Execution data. For this program, press a button labeled project data to make a user form show up. Scheduling. Scheduling work is carried on using a dialog designed for scheduling or entering scheduled data directly on the worksheet. Critical path analysis and generate schedule bar chart. The schedule becomes logical through critical path analysis. Early schedule is based on forward pass algorithm. Late schedule is based on backward pass algorithm. The early schedule is compared with late schedule to identify critical activities featured with zero float. Schedule restraint is considered in the critical path analysis. One typical constraint is civil readiness. Installation should be on hold till civil is ready, for example. Bar chart is created to reflect the resulting logical schedule. A placeholder to record actual progress. Progress worksheet is prepopulated with project data and schedule data. Actual progress are entered as achieved. The progress data are reflected into visualization tools and aggregated to represent high level summary including progress S curve. Project drawing. It is not common to include project drawing in project dashboard. It is possible using Excel drawing. The Excel drawing is based on each component's physical data, dimension, position, shape type, and so on. In Excel drawing, every component are made intelligible. When selecting a component, we could view related project and scheduled data. And dynamic simulation is made possible according to project schedule for path of execution review. Execution review session. We can review and update project data referring to project drawing. Execution sequence is reviewed. Project data including execution data are reviewed. Components project data is updated to ensure alignment with execution plan. Execution review by way of dynamic simulation. Dynamic simulation is performed to review the execution path referring to project schedule. Any anomaly or clashes are identified and suggest for optimization. One page presentation of execution plan and progress. This is a method to present all the activities together with their resources in a page. This is displayed in the form of skyline along the timeline. Resource profile using column and line chart along the timeline. 
Rear's profile chart are to present plan using column chart and resource supply limit using line chart. The resource chart is good to identify resource overshoot at the specific time period. Progress curve and skyline based on activity end date. Create conventional progress chart consisting of periodic column and cumulative line chart. Progress chart is presented in the shape of S curve and rundown curve. Skyline diagram based on activity end date is generated over the selected period. We are ending discussion about how to make a package program taking example of construction management program Moonstone. Lastly we will discuss the procedure to install an Excel add-in. Install Excel add-in. Select File, Options. On the Excel Options panel, select Add INS and in the Add INS window, go to Manage at the bottom. In the drop-down, select Excel Add INS and select Go. In the Add INS dialog, press Browse button and navigate your Excel add-in, Moonstone. Check a box by the check box for Moonstone and press OK button. Moonstone is added as a new tab on the ribbon. User interface adopted for the Moonstone is based on Ribonk's custom user interface.